When alkenes are treated with hydrochloric, hydrobromic, or hydroiodic acid, they undergo an addition process to form alkyl halides. The proton and halide add to the alkene to give saturated products, and if the alkene is unsymmetrical, we observe a distribution of regioisomeric products. The more highly substituted alkyl halide is usually isolated as the major isomer. The overall mechanism for this conversion involves the electron-rich double bond going after the very electrophilic acid, with the proton transfer resulting in a carbocation intermediate or intermediates. Since in this case the alkene is unsymmetrical, addition will result in two different carbocations, one being the more stabilized tertiary cation and the other the less stabilized secondary cation. Trapping of either intermediate with the bromide conjugate base then leads to the two alkyl halide products. The first step, the formation of the carbocation, is rate determining. Here, protonation may occur at either carbon and at either face of the alkene to produce the six electron tertiary and secondary carbocations. The tertiary pathway will be preferred due to significant electron donation from the nine adjacent beta bonds in the form of hyperconjugation. This selectivity is referred to as Markovnikov addition in which the major product will arise by the more stabilized carbocation intermediate. The second step in this pathway is fast trapping of the planar carbocations to give the stable, saturated alkyl halide products. In the case of the tertiary cation, which is not prochiral, attack occurs to give a single tertiary alkyl bromide that is symmetrical and achiral. In a separate process, the secondary carbocation is attacked by bromide nucleophile. However, this results in a mixture of four possible stereoisomers. Addition of proton to the alkene gives a prochiral carbocation, in which the proton may be above or below the plane of the molecule. The nucleophile may then donate into either side of the p orbital that constitutes the positive charge, thus resulting in all four stereoisomeric outcomes. Remember that two stereocenters means four possible isomers. Overall, the addition of an acid such as HBr to an alkene is known to go through carbocation intermediates to give alkyl halides. When the starting material is unsymmetrical, regioselective addition is observed with the major product arising through the more stabilized intermediate. Stereochemical issues arise in the products if the alkene and the intermediate have the potential to be flat and prochiral. Here, the major isomer is symmetrical and achiral, while the minor regioisomer is made up of four stereoisomers.